Good day. Welcome to Kim Wizard. I think we'll take a look at our 3DS collection. I've got a nice little selection of 3DS games so far. I've been slowly over time buying them. And sometimes I'll see them out in the wild, maybe at a garage sale. Not very often, though. It's mostly I buy stuff on Amazon or maybe an eBay one. But I'm going to kind of go through what I have so far. I've got maybe like about 20 games. And Paddington Adventures in London. I think this is one of those games I got for five bucks. I figured, why not? Oh, and here's an awesome game. Oh, Kirby's Epic Yarn. Fantastic game. I really like this game. I remember when this came out. Uh, I think it came out on the uh, Wii U. And uh, it's like, man, I gotta have that. Gotta have that. And this one's absolutely fantastic. Uh, Sega 3D Classics Collection. Uh, what it does, it has the six games. Oh, I think there's eight or eight or ten games. Maybe nine games on there. Uh, all from Sega. And some of the games, they, they tweaked it for the 3D. So when you turn it into 3D on the uh, 3DS, it really makes a much more fun game. Really, really cool. Get this. Pac-Man and Galaga Dimensions. Fantastic. Especially if you like like these games. Um, let's give it a little twist. A little more modern stuff. Really fun. A lot of... And it's a 3D. Now in 3D. So that's pretty cool. Let's see what we got here. Oh, love this game. Snoopy's Grand Adventure. I got this on the Xbox. Uh, let's see. 3DS. PlayStation. On the Xbox One. Or Xbox 360, Xbox One. Pretty much in every console. This is a lot of fun. And here's one. Frozen Olaf's Quest. This one I actually enjoy. It's a lot of fun. Especially if you just like Olaf. It's kind of fun. It's just like a platformer. Really fun. Really fun. And then Luigi's Mansion. Great game. You really you can't go wrong with any of the, the Luigi ones. And this one I was a little disappointed in. Ultimate NES Remix. Kind of like little clippets from different games. So that's kind of a little disappointing. I mean, it's still fun. You got a lot of the classic games from for the NES on there. So kind of neat. Now, ugh, next pile. We got Pokemon. Uh, Pokemon Moon. I got this at Target. They had like their bin where they're getting rid of all the 3DS games at the time. And I think it was like maybe $5. It wasn't much. So I bought this one. And of course, Ocarina of Time. Great game. Love this game. Especially with the, the 3D and stuff like that. You almost need the newer 3DS so you get the little pointer st stick so you can look around. But you can still play it with the, the original 3DS. Uh, Driver Renegade. Uh, this is a good game. A lot, a lot of bad language. Bad language, but still. A really fun game. Not for kids. Uh, Centipede Infestation. I always like Centipede and this is kind of a nice little updated version of it in 3D. Really fun. This one, I, I want to I play this some more. I played it. Love it. A lot of fun. I just got to find some more time to, to play Power of Illusion, Epic Mickey. Oh, and I did get a second Snoopy. I don't know how. I think I was at Goodwill or a garage sale. I got another Snoopy. Oh, yeah. $3. I wasn't going to pass it up. And, of course, you always got to have some crap. And this is one of the ones I got at Goodwill. A Nintendo Dogs and Cats. I think Golden Retriever Edition. Really nice. I have not even played this one yet. And Pokemon Sun, I've been playing this one. I played this one off and on. I gotta go back to play it again. After a while, it's kind of like you're just kind of walking around, but I like it. I gotta, I get a little farther on it. Okay, now for the last pile. Blah, get over here. Uh, you can see I got this one, Monster 13 Wishes. This is actually, I played a little bit of this. Got it at Goodwill. Uh, Monster High 13 Wishes. Never seen the cartoon, but I know what it's about. Yoshi's Woolly World. Love this game. I really like it. But I always like that they're all yarn and it's, it's it's a fun, fun game to play. And here's another great one. Frogger 3D. You kind of get a hint, hint. I like Frogger Centipede Pac-Man. Uh, especially when they modernize this. I like this because it starts off with the original Frogger and then it kind of jumps into the, the new game. And Donkey Kong Country 3D. I just got this one at Grasso for five bucks. I'm not going to pass it up because it's a great game. I wanted this for a while, but it's like 20, 30 bucks. But for five bucks, not a problem. Uh, Big Hero 6, got this one also for five bucks at a recent garage sale. I have not even tried this one yet. I'm going to give this one a play probably maybe this weekend or next weekend. i got to find some time for this one. And here's another one I got at a garage sale. Pac-Man and the Ghost Keys Mansion. I want this for quite a while. I just It's hard to spend the big money on the brand new, but if I can get it used, that's the way to go. And Tetris Ultimate, this is the game I play most. I like to play this right before bedtime. kind of calms you down, gets you ready for bed. And it's just a lot of fun. Good music, and good sound effects on it, and, and it's Tetris. You can't go wrong. And last, like golfing, Mario Golf World Tour. Just a 
great game. I always liked the, the Mario Golf ones. I had the demo of this, loved it. After, I gotta buy the game. I just bought the game because it's like, ugh, I like it so much. So anyway, that's the whole, I think that's all of them. That's all of them. And let me get them all here so you can kind of see. There's probably about 20 or so. Nice little stash. And they're all usually usually pretty good games. I got a couple like the Nintendogs and stuff like that are for kids. But for the most part, kind of adult fun games. So anyway, that's the haul. And that's what we got. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the video. That's you. Have a great day.